The plot really centers around a young man, his name is Frederick, and he's being released from his apprenticeship to a pirate ship, and of course he got on this pirate ship by mistake. When his indentures are up, he decides that it's his dutiful um, responsibility to leave the pirate band and live a peaceful life. You wouldn't find these people in real life because they're just so zany. I think it's full of nonsense and laughter and fighting and drama, but at the end of the day, like at the end of the final scene, it's about forgiveness. Something that's really unique about this production is that there are a lot of participants in the cast. We have 42 students in the cast, and that seems to be um, you know, one of the things I'm running up against lately is for a lot of reasons I'm directing large cast musicals. That's a big cast to kind of um, mix together and, and, and marry and, and make a cohesive you know, production. And it's really cool to see all of these people on stage at one time, but they, everybody has a place to go and everybody has something to say. I, I encourage the audience to look for those specific moments to pick out and see where all of the ensemble talent is. And the sets are going to be incredible. The set design um, is done by Sammy Nickel, one of our uh, uh, design students, and I gave her uh, an idea of, I would like a set that sort of looks two-dimensional in a three-dimensional world. You'll have these backdrops, which are very painted and obviously two-dimensional, but these amazing set pieces, which are like popping out at you, creating the 3D effect. And that's kind of what these characters are as well. Every person on stage, they all commit fully to portraying some kind of buffoon or character or, you know, two-dimensional person. You're seeing a lot of life on stage. Everybody brings a different life to each character that they're playing. When the audience comes and sees it, I hope that they just have as much fun watching it as we are performing it. Don't expect anything. <laughs> Tom will throw anything that he can to make this the biggest, most extravagant, most entertaining two hours. I've made a number of analogies to it. One of my analogies has been um, like a lemon meringue pie. It's very sweet. It's got a very light, you know, meringue crust on top of it. It's uh, fun to eat. The, the, the pure pleasure of what it's like to um, have a theatrical dessert for an evening. I think that that's the most important thing I'd like to have them take away too. Oh, and rubber chickens. <laughs> <laughs>